Now on Good Morning America with Oscar-nominated actress Florence Pugh. You know her from Little Women, Black Widow, Midsummer, and so many more. Now she's starring in A Good Person. Thank you so much oh, for yeah. being here. Busy day here of on course, GMA. Of course, busy day, but great to be here. Thank yeah, you for really, having me. really happy to see you. So last night I was online uh, doing my my homework, yeah. and um, over and over again, this is what I read that that. This movie fills your heart, that it is so poignant in, in the most perfect way. It's about a young woman um, finding hope in very unlikely places after yeah. enduring a, a really horrific tragedy. Yeah. Um, what was it like starring alongside Morgan Freeman and the ever delightful Molly Shannon? Oh my goodness. Well, I, I've already had the pleasure of working with some of the greats in, in this industry, but adding Molly and Morgan to that was just absolutely incredible. It's amazing to work with utter professionals. You just get to watch and learn and soak it all up. And, and uh, Molly's character is your mom. Yeah. That is fantastic. Great fit. It's mad. It's a bonkers household. But um, <laughs> yeah, it's a, a family that I'd like to be a part of. And, and Morgan um, is sort of an unexpected place of solace for you? Yeah, there's these two characters kind of come into each other's lives. Um, it's a very un unexpected friendship, but it's a friendship that's deeply needed and necessary. And I think you get to watch this, you know, older man suffering through the same things that this younger woman is. And um, hopefully they, they kind of help each other through this, this tough patch. Yeah. We have a clip. Yeah. Let's have everyone oh, take great. a look. Alison, don't go. This was a mistake. No, no, it isn't. Trust me. I know how hard it is to get here. It's damn near impossible and you did it. Don't run away now because of me. There are thousands of meetings. I'll find another one. Wow, yeah, but this one has the best snacks. I want to go. No, 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 you've made it this far, and I wouldn't. I don't want to be here. Nobody does in the beginning. I don't want to be anywhere. Then you are definitely in the right spot. Mm. It's like soul crushing. Well, it's, um, yeah, it's, that's an important scene. It's about the opioid crisis. Um, and it's the first time that she actually makes it and gets herself to AA. And uh, he happens to be there and he stops her from leaving. So it's very poignant. And despite it having a very sensitive and, and, and dark and sad topic, um, it's also really, it has moments of levity. It's funny. And Zach has written a, a fantastic script that kind of matches how we deal with times right. of, of, of sadness. The, 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 it, Zach's writing is fantastic, yeah. produced, directed, yeah. wrote it. Um, let's get into Molly Shannon. She yeah. was with us on Good Morning America I on heard. Monday. <laughs> um, and shared with us that uh, you guys have um, a wrestling, a scene in which you wrestle and you guys really got into it. Yeah, we fight. <laughs> <laughs> Who's stronger? Because I can't decide who my money would be on. She kept on coming up to me the other day. We had our premiere uh, two nights ago, or maybe it was last night, I can't remember. <laughs> and she was like, you know, you're so stocky and feisty, and, and I love <laughs> fighting with you. I genuinely think that we, like, we, we matched each other perfectly, and so much so, halfway through the fighting, instead of, like, maybe us just calming down and not fighting as hard. She was like, I think we need to put pads on so that we can fight more. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, yeah so then we put in. pads on and we were just jamming each other into mirrors. It was great. That is so fun. <laughs> uh, I was also uh, reading that your parents are, are so very proud of you. Even now, as you make all of these movies yeah. and are becoming a bigger star, yeah. they still clip every magazine article, oh, yeah. every newspaper clip. And they don't just get one newspaper. It's like seven in case any anyone needs one. That's so precious. Yeah. <laughs> they must be very proud. That must be a very big box. Well, it's, yeah, it's also, it's like, it's, this is um, a bizarre uh, life that's unfolding, and I think they're just, they're proud of all of their babies, so whenever there's a clipping, they're like, <gasps> <laughs> yeah, no, as a mom, I totally get it, and I, I now have my mom's box oh, of clippings. Really? So you will one yeah. day really receive it and it. not have a clue what to do. With no, it. it's in a closet, <laughs> and every once in a while, I like put it out in front of my daughter, hoping she might leaf through it. No luck yet, no. but you know, a girl Aww. can dream. It's so precious of the, of your parents, though. Uh, I want to get back to the movie. In one yep. scene, your character. Um, cuts off all of her hair. Yes. And this was the decision behind the scenes that um, you and Zach may not have seen eye to eye on. I thought it was a really important thing to do. I think we, we meet our character a year later after this tragic accident. And I just thought it was really important for the audience to see that she is a completely changed and different woman and that she is literally chopping pieces of herself off. And it all 
also, in some way, gets all the vanity out the window. You don't look right. at this character in the same way that you probably would do. Um, she is at rock bottom, and she looks um, wonderfully mad at, at whilst doing so. So I, th I thought it was really important as a performer and also visually for the audience to just see that it's a, ch a changed being. Yeah, yeah no, the, I mean... But Zach wasn't very happy about it because it meant that scheduling, it was a nightmare, and he kept on coming to me saying, OK, so the thing is, is it's a great idea, <laughs> but it's just going to mean that scheduling is, like, nightmare right. and we won't the be The producer able to do it. was coming out. Yeah, and I would just turn to him and be like, you'll figure it out. <laughs> and then he would, he, would, he would talk to the other producers and talk to the ADs, and they'd be like, Zach, well, this can't happen. You're going to have to tell her that she, this, this, she cannot but do this. But in the end, he agreed that it was, it yeah. really, it, it's very symbolic. I said, figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we know who the boss is. Um, I, just before we go, congrats on Dune 2. Thank you. That's just wrapped? I'm so, well, I, I wrapped ages ago, but I think, yeah, they just wrapped before Christmas. Anything you can share with us? Because it has such a following. Absolutely nothing, other than the fact that... <laughs> <laughs> Girl can try. <laughs> um, Come uh, on. Other than the fact that I, um, yeah, that was as, as mad for me being on it as it was for people. I, it's, it, that movie is just, I'm, I'm so proud and excited to be a part of that world. Love so everything proud. you do. Thank it was, you. It was great to see you at the Oscars. You yeah. Were beautiful. Thank you so much. And uh, looking forward to all the the rest. But first, everybody, check out a good person. Yes. And you are. Thank you so much for Thank being you. with us, Florence. Thank you. Uh, a, good, being here. a good person is in Friday in theaters this Friday. Don't miss it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.